So, ladies and gentlemen, we have done it. We have created a sexually mature adult female 3D base model. Fully weight painted, rigged and ready to go with 148 total bones, 22 correction bones, 49 correction drivers, 59 mesh correctional shape keys, 59 shape key drivers, 49 poses and 4 organized libraries. With hair physics, jiggle physics, and color coordinated, custom designed, easy to see bone shapes for the left and and right side of the body. Ladies and gentlemen, she's all yours. In the next few videos, I'll show you how to modify the rig and transfer the white paint data from Blender to your own character, the same way that Rigify does. But in the meanwhile, feel free to reverse engineer it, steal pieces of it, or use the rig for whatever you want. The creation of this rig and the tutorials teaching you how to build it were all funded by the brave names you see here on the screen. Every month, these troopers sacrifice a piece of their hard-earned money in order for you guys to be able to download and learn this stuff for free. Corona hit us pretty hard last month, and a few members of the squad lost their jobs and they weren't able to support anymore. Some of you even messaged me about your situation and tried apologizing for it. To anyone in this situation, I just wanted to say, please don't worry about it. The last thing that I would ever want for anyone supporting the channel is to be starving in the background. Seriously guys, that's not cool. So please just stay safe and do whatever you gotta do to keep your life intact. I'm more than happy to just have you guys here enjoying the show. Simply leaving a like or a funny comment for me to read is already more than I could ever ask for. And because I don't think it's fair to blame someone for being in this kind of shitty situation, this month I'm not gonna take anyone's name off the website. Thank you for everything up to now, and I hope you guys are staying safe and hanging in there till this is all over. Also, somehow, we officially had 10,000 new faces join in the last 16 days. So if you're new here, welcome to the channel, and glad to have you aboard. Unfortunately, those of you who've been here for a while know that YouTube's been real rough for me. It's actually gotten worse. See this? This is a list of all the words that get you demonetized on YouTube, which means you can't have these words appear in the title, description, thumbnail, or tags without getting hit in the bank. You can't even say the words because auto caption will usually pick it up and hit you from behind. So if your video is related to any of these words, you are shit out of luck, especially when it comes to people being able to find your content. And unfortunately for us, the last three months I've been trying to teach you how to rig the human body. And as it turns out, teaching 3D artists how to recreate the human body is apparently wildly inappropriate. You remember the download video for Blenda? Well that got hit with demonetization for having sexual content. I'm not even joking. Every other video my thumbnails get flagged for nudity. Which is kind of funny because the censored version of the thumbnails often look even more provocative than the original. Rigging the human body is hard. The first time I tried it was a total shit fest. That is why I started the series in the first place. But it's really f hard to teach people how to animate and rig the human body if you're not allowed to show people the goddamn human f body. It's even harder when you're not allowed to talk about the human body or use words describing the human body in your tags. Like, let's be real here. Do you really think that anyone who's looking for this information is going into the search bar and typing in buttocks rigging or tush cheek animation or weight painting the gluteus maximus? No! Nobody talks like that. Nobody thinks like that. If people want to find the stuff, then they type in how to rig ass, realistic boobs, breast animation. That is how people talk. That is how people look this shit up. But I can't use any of those words my tags without getting flagged like a match between red versus blue. So, for those of you who are leaving a like or dropping a comment after each video, you are my hero. And you're the only thing keeping this channel above the water. Because trying to stay alive on YouTube is like trying to keep a fire alive on top of water in a snowstorm with nothing but friendship. So, thank you. Also, speaking of comments and stupid things YouTube does, I just realized that YouTube has been secretly flagging your comments behind my back. Recently, I just checked my spam comments folder and there was like a couple hundred comments there and most of them were obviously not spam. Usually it's just people trying to support the show. So if any of you left a comment and wondered why it's not showing up, please just know that I didn't delete it. More than likely YouTube's just being a dumbass and so I apologize if that confuses anyone. Anyway, now that the rigging series is complete, we will now be moving to the animation series. Specifically, creating animations in preparation for game design. This is the series that I have been looking forward to all year. Character animation is my favorite part of the 3D process, so I am super excited to finally share this stuff with you. And in preparation for this series, I'm gonna spend the next few days designing the main character that we will be using in our game. So the next time you see Blenda, you might not recognize it, but I think you're gonna like what you see. Anyway, thanks for watching and hope you had fun. As always, hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you around.